Hi, welcome to Ground Zero, where we bring you issues close to the hearts of Singaporeans. I'm Amanda. And I'm Kenneth. And we have an interesting lineup of stories for you this week. So let's check out some of the most popular entries up on Stomp. First up, more and more teenagers are performing dangerous stunts. That's right, there are several entries on Storm that showed youths engaging in some very risky behaviour. The first is a young girl who was photographed sitting on the edge of the MRT platform. She appeared to be posing for pictures and looking very relaxed. Well, that's quite dangerous, isn't it? Yeah. The train may come suddenly and she could be hurt. Well, maybe she's just a daredevil or maybe she just wants the attention. You know, nowadays people like to post stuff like this online. Maybe, but that's not the way to go. I mean, whatever happened to the regular smiley post pictures? <laughs> exactly, as Stomper J. Rebecca said, nowadays youngsters want to just show how daring they are. But you shouldn't risk your life just to prove a point. Well, another Stomper, Stompers123, feels that the girl is totally at fault and her actions are wrong to the core. The staff should take measures in future to prevent such acts. Well, she's not the only one. A Tomasic Polytechnic student was caught on video climbing up some scaffolding at the school's engineering faculty. According to the Stomper, the man was risking his life for the sake of winning a dare. Yeah, in the videos, the man was seen scaling the scaffolding, which is quite high. It reaches up to the ceiling. Well, there's a voice telling the man that he has won and asking him to come down, but he ignored the call and continued to climb upwards. Well, definitely risky behaviour. Would you do something like that? Maybe if I was Spider-Man? I don't know. Jokes aside, it's not for me. La. It's like what the Stomper said. People should value their lives more than their egos. A moment of folly could cause a lifetime of regret. And I totally agree. Wise words. Mm. <laughs> well, this next story really gets on my nerves. <laughs> well, it's a video <laughs> sent in by Stomper Janice and it appears to be a, a prank that was filmed on, on video. Apparently, a group of pranksters have placed four cardboard boxes in a straight line in the middle of the road, making it very difficult for cars to drive through. While well, the location was along West Coast Road. Well, not very considerate, aren't they? I mean, to be honest, I love playing pranks on people, but nothing like this. This is, this is crossing the line. When you endanger the lives of others, it's a bit too much. Yeah, accidents could have happened. Sometimes I think, you know, people just don't consider their actions before they act. I'm not talking about me lah, I mean, seriously. But I guess it's just a spur of the moment thing, but we don't really know exactly why they did it. Stomper Janice said the video was posted up on Facebook by a guy named Isaac Wee. And the video information states that it was taken at about 2am in the morning. What were they doing out playing pranks so late in the night? No idea, but you know, this story had quite a few Stompers sharing their views. Stompers Louis Le LK said, this isn't funny at all. These pranksters should be taught a severe lesson for messing around with other people's lives and safety. Well, another stomper, Bad Blood 13, agrees. Well, he or she said, what if an accident happens? Well, the pranksters shouldn't endanger other people's lives for their own pleasure and entertainment. Well, another stomper, Holy Donkey, said the police should catch these juveniles and put them behind bars. And why do you think young people are doing this nowadays? Posting pictures or videos of themselves doing stupid things? fame perhaps or the thrill factor or maybe they just want attention i mean it's the internet age now everyone can be famous online whether for the right or the wrong reasons well i don't think you want to be famous for doing stuff like this right but whatever the reason i guess it's always good to remember it's better to be safe than to be sorry that's right well next up our drivers here going too fast we check out some very extreme car accidents in singapore